we're about to see a PDF document uploaded into Kix and then served back out again. Technical architecture shown on the screen here right now. I'm working on my Apple MacBook. And um, you're about to see what I'm saying there. So here we have the upload facility loaded into a browser. There's a hotspot on the top right of the corner. You can either click that to open a file dialog, but I'm going to drag and drop from a finder a PDF document onto that hotspot. And there it is. It's uploaded into the web page and we can see the file name and its size. We now need to give this a name. We're going to save it into the PDF repository. So the URL field starts slash PDF slash and then we'll give it a file name. I'm simply going to call it data sheet. PDF and now we'll upload that and it comes back and says yes upload successful so we will go to the directory facility at the moment we're focused on the PDF file already and there's only a placeholder in there but we'll hit the load button you can see now there are four records rather than one and there is the file that we've simply uploaded and in fact it's so large it's been split behind the scenes into multiple records which are stitched together when the when the uh, record is called and you can see a representation of the data there but if we go back to the main URL click on that a new tab is opened and that PDF is served back to the browser it really is as simple as that if you want to know more please get in touch with us